Today's stage ends on the highest mountain of the Massif Central, the 1850 meter high Puy Marie. But in the past, it has been much bigger. Now, all of these white peaks may look like separate hills, but they were in fact once part of one single mountain, 70 kilometers at the base, four kilometers high, and shaped like a massive cone. That is Europe's supervolcano. The shapes of the valleys in the mountain now tell us that it was decapitated by glaciers in the ice ages, but it's in the processes that built the volcano that we find my favorite story of this year's Tour de France. Strata volcanoes are made out of a sticky magma. Lavas that come out of the crater don't travel very far, and that's why they make these steep cone shapes. Sometimes those volcanoes blow their head off, and ashes and big bombs like these are spread out in a perimeter around the volcano. But farther still go the ashes and the gases that are injected into the stratosphere, and those can have unexpected side effects. The largest eruption in modern history occurred in 1815. The Tambora volcano in Indonesia exploded, and 70,000 people perished right then and there. The ash cloud went up into the stratosphere, 45 kilometers high, and spread globally. Here in Europe, that led to days without light, it led to torrential rains, and it led to very low temperatures. 1816 was known as the year without summer. Thousands of people died because crops failed. Tens of thousands of horses died because they starved and because they were eaten. But horses were the main means of transportation. In 1817, a German inventor called Karl von Dreis came with a solution. The Laufmaschine, or the running machine. Two wooden wheels, a frame, a saddle and two handlebars. It may not have passed the UCI regulations, but the bike was invented because of the volcanic eruption. Geology meets Tour de France. We really hope that you're enjoying our clips of the geology of the Tour de France and other cycling races, and we love bringing it to you. And there's plenty where that came from, but we can't do it without your financial support. So click on the link, consider a donation, and we hope to see you next year.